Yo, what's up, everybody? This your man, Chris Thorns. As always, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, whenever you watch my content. As always, like, comment, subscribe, and share. I can't, I'm already laughing already about this video I'm about to do. So, uh, check this out. Let me pause this real quick. Let me pause this real quick. Uh, <laughs> you know what? In life, I guess we get put in situations that we can control. And I guess we get put in situations that we can't control. But now with the situation that you can't control, I mean, I think you could always have some kind of rectification to rectify where you fucked up on. Whatever it's your friends putting you in a position that you didn't want to be in, you know, you just get away from their friends. Or, you know, your mom or your dad put you in a fucked up uh, situation, you know, you feed them with a long handle spoon, like they say. Um, or even if it's a boyfriend or a girlfriend, you know, they do some fuck shit to you, depending on how uh, bad the fuck shit was, you know, hey, do the same thing with them, you know, you feed them with a long handle spoon. Okay? But what I'm about to sit up here and show y'all right now, somebody has sent me this a while back, and I posted Ben got to it. I just so happened to ran into it looking through my files and stuff and I found this and I just like wow because it seemed like today our young females of this generation and a lot of grown females in this generation just don't give a fuck about what they put up and don't give a fuck about what they do let me show you what I'm talking about I want y'all to see this tweet. <clears throat> In this tweet, it says, had a job interview today, fucked the manager, and walked out with a new job, making $7.25 an hour, and y'all still asking y'all parents for money. Can't relate with the laughing faces. <clears throat> now, I'm going to say this right here. I thought this was fake, but apparently it's, I, well, I don't know if the shit fake or not. You know, a lot of people know how to do shit with computers or whatnot, but I'm going to go on a limb and say that this is not fake because I just seen it uh, on other places too. Now you see right here, the picture right there, that look like a young girl or whatnot. And you happy about making $7.25 an hour? Seriously? Are you seriously happy about making $7.25 an hour. That's fucking minimum wage. But then again, by how young she looks in this picture, maybe she's still in high school. So maybe there is a lot of money to her. You know? As she's saying, y'all still gotta ask y'all parents for money. Can't relate. Well, dear, you still gotta do it too. If my calculations are right, look at that shit. If my calculations are right, you look no more probably about somewhere between 14 and 16 in this picture. But you could be a little older or you could be younger, you know? So depending on how many hours you get for working 725 an hour, baby, trust me, you still gonna be uh, asking your moms and your dad for some money. So you get the fuck out of here with that. Seriously. Now, I don't know where this person get this from, whoever put this up, where they get this from to even to be proud to go in and fuck somebody just to get a minimum wage ass job. I don't know who would be proud to do that. Now, I probably would have respected just a little bit better if you was at the job and you fucked the manager, you got a raise and a nice raise too, then, you know, and shit, I can respect it then. But you fuck somebody just to get a 725 hour job. Are you proud of this? You proud to put this on Twitter? Come on, ma'am. Come on. You you can't be serious. And somebody just made my man hug and made me this meme right here. I want, I want y'all to see what this meme says. Having sex to earn a job for minimum wage, no application needed. He absolutely right. I mean, shit, the way she put this shit up, no application needed. Just go in there and fuck him real good. And you, get, you got a job. 
but I ain't gonna pay you shit. I mean, seriously. But now, like I said, though, if, if she's in high school, then yes, maybe this is some money to her. Um, and maybe she can start getting her own shit. But see, that only depends on how many hours she getting at it. It also depends on if she getting paid weekly or bi-weekly. Because getting paid weekly and bi-weekly does make a difference. It, it, it really does to me. You, can't, you get paid bi-weekly, you know, I mean, you probably get a little bit more. But you getting paid weekly depending on how many hours you get, man. Your check ain't going to be about shit. But again, like I said, if she's in high school, the way she, if she's in high school or something like that, Cause she look real young. If she's in high school, then you know maybe this can help her out with whatever she need for school, you know. But at the end of the day, you know, for you to put up a meme like this, talking about y'all still asking y'all a parent for money, you can't relate. No, you can't relate, dear. Cause trust me, you still gonna be asking your mom them for money or whatnot. Trust me, you gonna be asking them for money. You ain't gonna stop pretty much asking them for money until you get out, until you get your own shit. But depend on how you are with your parents. Depending on how you are with them, how cool you are, they probably still spoil you. They still help you out. Give you a little something here and there and the other. But I hope they will teach you something and instill in you that if you older now, you out of your own shit, 725 ain't going to do a goddamn thing for you as a grown-ass woman. They ain't going to do a goddamn thing for you. As a grown ass woman. Now, I guess unless, unless you're living in a shitty ass environment where the, uh, the economy is low, or maybe you got Section 8 housing, you know, maybe it worked for you then. But if you got a decent place to stay, 725 ain't gonna do shit for you. Or, or hold on, or I even go so far as say maybe you know how to budget your money, then maybe it can. Who the fuck wanna be grown making 725? Seriously, what grown ass one more grown ass man want to make 725 an hour? I know I won't be satisfied with it. And I know I preach a crawl before you walk. But goddamn though, you know, when you grown, it's time to up. Not go back down. It's time to go up. But now if you are cool, male or female, if you are cool making that minimum wage money like that, if you fine with it, then, hey, you like it, I love it. I'm just saying, when you get grown, I think it's time to get something a little bit better. I mean, honestly. But then again, in these days and age, to give you a little bit of credit, man, whoever you are, to give you a little bit of credit, it appears that no matter what job you work, you ain't getting paid what you work. So, you know, I would give you that. No matter where you're working at, you're not getting paid what you work. And I always ask people this. What a word it would be if we could all have a free check when shit come out of it. Just a free check. We get what we really earn. No taxes, no nothing. A free check with shit and ain't shit coming out of it. What a world would this be? But then again, I ask this question too. Would we really accept that? How will we act if that was to happen? Just saying. Young lady, whoever you is that did this tweet if it is real baby know your work trust me know your work because uh it ain't nothing to, to gloat about you going there fucking somebody just to get a a minimum wage ass job and it ain't nothing to gloat about as a matter of fact it ain't really nothing to gloat about to gloat about going there and fuck somebody you know what i'm saying get a, 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 a job paying out of that i mean that's that's nothing to gloat about if you ask me just saying. I'm just saying. Way to start 2018, people. 2018 is in full effect already. <laughs> anyway, this your man, Chris Thorns. No, leave y'all thoughts. And as always, like, comment, subscribe, and share. Now, y'all tell me what y'all think about this. You know, this is a motherfucking ridiculous. As always, this is a motherfucking ridiculous. As a matter of fact, let me show y'all this again. Peace out, y'all.